Now this is a video I never thought I would make. Kyan Anthony and Bryce James, two sons of NBA players, of course, Melo and LeBron. But Kyan is exposing Bryce James and no one is realizing why. Now, number one, we got to talk about Bryce James. Bryce James just recently had his first game for his, this new AU team that he is hooping for. He's playing with Mercy Miller, and I'm not going to lie, what the media is doing with this is insane. Now, like usual, they put Bryce's name in the title, and what happens? Bryce has just about one highlight in all of these games. Now, I was going through a ton of comments, and man, the way that they were talking about Bryce, and even the beef that was going on in these comments was crazy. Now, we look at this one comment, and I'm assuming this is somebody that actually played in the game. It said, we ran them out the gym. Man, those are those are fighting words. You got to be careful with how you proceed and especially how you talk to people online. Now, this actually said they won the game 86 to 70. And that's insane. And if you keep looking at some of these other comments, we cooked them by like 20. And it's crazy because, I mean, the media would have you thinking that these dudes were winning every single game, that there was no one out there really competing with them. And when we really take a look at what's going on in these games, I mean, they're saying Bryce James has one highlight he's not even really scoring like that i even see one here bro had three points smh i mean i'm starting to see a lot more of these comments where people are basically saying and they're calling him out basically saying bryce james is overrated and you're seeing it in these games now i'm getting a little concerned because i'm not gonna lie if i'm not wrong i believe bryce is around a junior as of right now number one and number two I'm wondering, is he playing up? Because low-key, I, I don't think these guys are that much older than him, if anything. So, yes, you can have a couple bad games, but only putting up, you know, three points here and there is not going to get you to the league and is definitely having me concerned. Now, if you do enjoy these types of videos and want to stay up to date with the latest and greatest high school, college, and NBA basketball, like the video and subscribe to the channel. We're on the road to 100,000 subscribers and just hit around 21K. So if you do enjoy these types of videos and want to stay up to date, hit the like and subscribe button now. Now I'm going to say this, man, because Kyan is really exposing what's going on with Bryce. Now the reason I say this is because number one, man, we see some information coming out about the rankings and how these dudes are ranked. Now it's crazy to think that both of these players are a four-star recruits in their in their class, but you see the difference. I mean, we look at Kyan, he is doing his thing on the court playing pretty well, looks aggressive, and then you see Bryce on the other hand who yes is 6'6", six, six, but overall is almost just not putting up the type of numbers to sometimes get this type of credibility if I'm being honest. And people are going to call me hating talking about somebody like Bryce. But at the end of the day, I think it needs to be said. I don't know. It's looking kind of shaky. But I'm not going to lie. Bronny did go through something very similar. Now, we did actually recently even see Kyan visit a school. If, if you see this picture right here, we see he's with his family there. And he is actually taking that official visit to Florida State. Now, it's interesting as well to see where Kyan is going to go in the future. But it looks fire to see him. And bro, do you see Melo? Let's talk about Melo squeezed into that track and field jersey right there. It's looking real tight. Pause. But I mean, it's crazy to think that both these guys are four-star recruits. And I'm not going to lie, man. Only time will tell. But low-key, it's looking crazy in this high school basketball scene. Now, if you love basketball stories, you won't want to miss this next video. So click the video on the screen now.